दिस इज लॉजिटेक के थ्री एटी वायरलेस ब्लूटूथ की बोर्ड प्रोबेबली द बेस्ट रिप्लेसमेंट फॉर एपल्स मैजिक की बोर्ड आई हैव बीन यूजिंग दिस की बोर्ड फॉर क्वाइट सम टाइम लेट्स ब्रेक डाउन द प्रोस एंड कॉन्स ऑफ इट एंड फाइंड आउट वेदर इज इट वर्थ बाइंग इन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू एंड वेदर यू शुड बाई इट और नॉट दिस इज मिस्टर एस्क्वेटेक लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड First let's talk about the design. The keyboard is very simple and minimal in design. There is one on and off switch on the left. A light will blink indicating that it is on. It takes two AAA batteries which comes with the keyboard in the box and lasts for more than 2 years. The keyboard layout is similar to that of Apple's Magic Keyboard. If you don't want to pay that premium extra money of yours then check this keyboard. The keyboard comes with these rounded keys which are silent as night. Here is a sample typing test. The typing experience is same as that of Magic Keyboard since they share the same layout. There is a bit of key travel, but one will get used to it. The keyboard has the Command and Alt buttons, and Start and Option button labeled, and it works with both Windows and Mac seamlessly. Now let's talk about some pros and cons of the keyboard. As you already know by now. you can pair up to 3 devices on the keyboard in place of function keys f1 f2 and f3 it is labeled as 1 2 and 3 meaning each number indicates one connected device and connecting to the device is just a touch of button away the pairing is pretty simple just long press on the button on the keyboard until the light blinks continuously on your connecting device the keyboard would show up and all you need to do is select and pair that's it you're ready to go and you can start typing if you want to switch between the devices then all you need to do is the respective button on the keyboard and it instantly switches to that device by the way this keyboard works with iPads iPhones Android tablets and phones The second pro of the keyboard is the size and its lightweight. The keyboard is just weighs around 400 grams and it doesn't feel heavy. You can tuck it in your backpack pretty easily when you have to carry it around. Just for the size comparison, this is my regular keyboard and this is K380 keyboard. Look how small it is. It is insanely compact. Another pro or reason to buy this keyboard is the battery life. The battery life on this keyboard is longer than few animals or species lifetime and it's no joke. It runs on two AAA batteries they come with the keyboard. They last for more than 2 years. Pretty much all the Logitech keyboard or mouse battery life is just superior. The keyboard comes in white, black, navy blue and baby pink colors. Whatever your desk setup is, it smoothly blends in with the theme of your desk and color vibe. Initially, it takes some time to get used to this keyboard, but once you are used to it, then you would love it. If you are someone who types mostly on your Mac, and you are buying this keyboard then you don't feel a difference at all now let's talk about some cons of the keyboard the first and foremost con of the K380 keyboard is it's pretty old logitech introduced this keyboard in late 2015s and it is still the same keyboard it got few updates in 2017 internally and released in new colors 
but design wise it's pretty much the same as in 2015. If you are someone who likes typing on the mechanical keyboards and you buying this, you may not enjoy typing on it as much as you do on the mechanical keyboard. And that's all for the cons. I didn't find much negatives about this keyboard. If you are looking for a practical yet affordable and beautiful keyboard, then blindly buy this one. You will love it. It gives really smooth and silent typing experience. In fact, I really enjoyed typing the script for this video. If you want to buy a keyboard for your MacBook or Mac Mini, then look no further. It's right here. It is the best replacement for Apple's Magic Keyboard. Overall, it is a practical yet good looking and aesthetically pleasing keyboard. So that's it guys. I hope I gave you some heads up on this keyboard. If you enjoyed watching the video, please give it a like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. See you in another video.